Hey y'all, welcome to the replay. Today I'm going to be using the home transfer and the military emblems. I'm working with a piece of wood that I stained and I'm using some of the Minwax finishing paste to go ahead and wax that board to put a layer between the stain and the transfer. Just getting this board waxed up. While I finish this, here's a little insert of what Chalk Couture is. Now the board is all waxed and ready to go. So I am using the Fawn um, colored paste and I'm just getting that all stirred up so it's a creamy yogurt consistency. Now I'm going to pull the home transfer from its backer sheet. And it's the first time that I've used it, so I'm going to go ahead and fuzz it with my fuzz cloth. And then I'm just going to place it down and get it all smoothed out, making sure that there's no bubbles in the silk screen. I'm also going to be using a small squeegee. And I'm going to start just putting that Fawn Chalkology chalk paste across the silk screens, getting them all filled in and squeegeeing off the excess. Then I'm going to go ahead and peel up that transfer and get it into some water. Then I was playing around with some of the there's no place like part. Trying to see if I could get that to fit on there. Um, I don't think I ended up using it. Um, but I'm just grabbing my heat tool, sorry for the shakiness, grabbing my heat tool um, so I can get the words H, M, and E all dried because I'm going to be doing some layering. And then I played again with that, there's no place like from the, no pl the home sweet home transfer. And actually I did get it to work, so I just placed some Fawn Chalkology Chalk Paste to cover the silk screens. And then just squeegeed off the excess and put it back in the jar. And then I peeled up that part of the transfer and used my heat tool again to get that all dried, just so that it wouldn't smear. Then I pulled out the military emblems because one of those emblems is going to be used as the O. And I've never used them before, so I went ahead and cut them apart. And I think I settled on the marine symbol. So I went ahead and peeled that from its backer sheet and got it fuzzed up on my fuzz cloth. And then I just put it in the space where the O would be. and got it centered and placed right where I want it, making sure that there were no air bubbles in it. And then just used some more of that Fawn Chalkology Chalk Paste to cover in all the silk screen areas, making sure they were all covered, and then squeegeeing off the excess and putting it back in the jar. And I peeled that up and put that into some water to get it cleaned off. I also used my heat tool again to heat set that symbol. And ta-da, there you go. There's the finished project. If you like what you see and you'd like to see more, check me out on my online store. If you like what you'd see and you'd like to buy your business in a box, here's a picture of all that you get with the new transfer for $99 US or 